So how do you download the books to the iPad? So you have some options. First of all, there is the dedicated books app from Apple, right? So this is the orange icon. If you cannot find it, you should be able to get it inside of the app store and re-download it. So you can open it up like this and you have some options, of course, to access your existing library, but you can also go to the bookstore and there either purchase or even get some free uh, books if they are available, right? So you have even some paid and free books, which you can go and just get and read downloads to your iPad. So that's like one option. Another very popular platform is the Kindle, which is actually from Amazon. And it has its own dedicated app where you need to sign in with your Amazon account or create one. And this is great as well because you can access the extensive Amazon library. And if you have purchased some Amazon Kindle books before, you also will have the ability to access it right here. The cool thing about it is that it also syncs with your Kindle device if you have one, right? So like the e-reader device, if you have it, then it also syncs the library and all of the notes and highlights with that device. So this is like, these are the two main ways how people download books to the iPad. But also if you have some free books, like I could show you inside of the you know, the books app that there are some books which are for free. If you have access to those somewhere on the internet, like in a PDF format or something, you can also download it to your iPad and read it inside of the files app, for example. Or if you have some books purchased before, you can also import them to your iPad some other way. But as I've shown you, the books app and Kindle are the two most popular options. Let me know if it works for you. Most definitely subscribe and hit the thumbs up. And I'm going to catch you later in the next tutorials.